Hi everyone, my name is Michelle and today we will be looking at how to obtain the highest possible score on the listening part of the IELTS exam. The listening test is the exact same test for both the academic and general training versions of the IELTS exam and it is normally the first part of the IELTS exam. The listening test is 30 minutes long with an additional 10 minutes transfer time at the end of the exam to transfer your answers to the answer sheet. It is important to remember that the tape is only played once, so you need to listen carefully. There are four sections in the listening part of the IELTS exam, with 10 questions in each section, so 40 questions in total. It is also important to remember that each question is worth one mark, um, so the listening test is worth a total of 40 marks. You may be asked to answer multiple choice questions, label a plan, map or diagram, fill in a form, complete a table, complete a flowchart, or give short answers. Section one is the easiest section, and section four is the hardest section. In section one, you will hear a conversation between two people, and this section tests your basic English, such as names and numbers. In section two, you will hear only one person talking. It will be on a general everyday topic, for example, speech on how to book a tour. In section three, you will hear anywhere from two to four spe speakers having a conversation in an academic situation. For example, you may hear a teacher and a student discussing an assignment or a group of students chatting in about um, an, an exam. And in section four, you will hear one person speaking about an academic subject. For example, a lecturer giving a lecture in a lecture hall. You have extra time at the end of each section to check your answers and to look at the questions in the next section before it is played. The IELTS exam is based on British English, so you will be listening to British speakers, Australian speakers and even speakers from New Zealand. The key to getting a high mark for the listening part of the IELTS exam is understanding the layout of the exam. In other words, knowing the exam lasts 30 minutes, that there are four sections in the exam, that each section has 10 questions, that you will hear two people having a conversation in section one and one person speaking in section two, that each question is worth one mark. The second key to getting a high mark for the listening test is practice. Practice as many listening IELTS exams as you can. Practice each exam over and over. The more you practice, the better you will become. In the next video, we will practice an IELTS listening exam together. See you soon.